So ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Rumbooks channel. Yes, it's been a while and I'm finally going to be back at it. Laptop's been fixed, a whole bunch of things have gone on, uh, personal life, etc. Not going to get into it. So this is going to be a very quick video where I'm going to teach you how to make a whiskey sour. It's part of my new segment, Weekly Cocktails. Just in time for Friday, your 10th boom. This week, these will be published. Uh, sorry, I was a little bit. I tend to do that. Um, these are my new <laughs> cocktails that are very quick and easy to make. These will be going up every Friday at about 1 pm European Standard Time. So kick back, relax, and uh, watch the introduction. I'll be right back in two seconds. So ladies and gentlemen, okay, to make a whiskey sour, it's very, very easy. You're gonna need some sugar syrup. You're gonna need a lemon, which you're gonna juice. You're gonna need a cocktail shaker. You're gonna need some ice. Now, some cocktail, now some uh, mixologists, some bartenders, they like to put an egg and they like to put some mangosteria bitters in their whiskey sours. Me, I do not. The only place this egg is going to be going is back in the box to go in my breakfast later. I mean, a nice little omelette. So those are going to go in the fridge, well out of the way. So, very simple, its ingredients are 50 millimeters of whiskey. For this, I'm using Bullet Bourbon. It's a great whiskey to use just for, for this indeed and uh, sugar syrup you can either make it yourself or you can make it at home so it's 50 millimeters of sugar syrup 25 millimeters of the sugar uh, sorry 10 millimeters of whiskey 25 millimeters of sugar syrup and 25 millimeters of freshly squeezed lemon juice you can use the bottle stuff but i'd rather but i personally prefer the taste of the fresh stuff so give me two seconds and i shall prepare everything and be right back to you okay so that's all now prepared i'm going to quickly show you what we're going to do so uh, <clears throat> sorry, the voice is going in a little bit. I've had a bit of a cold, and whiskey is very, very good for a cold health. It opens things up, so I've heard. So, if you have one of these, if you, if you have one of these, fantastic. Makes your job a heck of a lot easier. First and foremost, what you do is you take the ice, throw it in the shaker, And add a bit of extra lemon to get the lemon zest in there as well. I take one slice, one thick cut slice of lemon, throw it in the shaker. Now this makes life a bit easier. This is 50 millimeters, this is 25. So 50 millimeters of bourbon, here we go. Bourbon, whiskey, your blended scotch. Don't use single malt, please. You want some nice flavor to it. And yes, I recommend fresh lemon juice. It is a pain in the you know what, but it's really worthwhile just for the flavor itself. Right, now that's done. I'm gonna start with some chicken. Take one or two of ice will do nicely. Can only do that better. Now here is where the magic happens. I'm gonna speed it up a little bit. That's done. I normally have my strainer, which I don't right now. Some ice in the glass. And then just pour it out. And then, of course, final touch, the decoration. Simple but effective decoration always goes a long way. Now, the color of that is absolutely perfect. Let's bring it closer. There you are. Last thing you need to do, of course, cheers. Here's to you, and thank you very much for joining us today. And 
that is how a whiskey shower should be. It's crisp, refreshing, cold and relaxing. With eggs and extra bitters, it becomes much like a protein shake. You want one of those, go to the gym. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for joining. Sorry for it's been so long, but keep an eye out for my future videos. There will be a lot more coming. I'm back, so here's to the return. Let's give me a very close look. I hope you're jealous. Cheers.